Hi Gemini, it's L here to do your mid-March 2019 general reading. It's a general reading, so it may not resonate with each and every Gemini who views the video, but if it resonates with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. All right, so thank you to those who have already done so. Um, all of my information is below. Email, uh, web address, uh, to book a, a reading, go to the website. So you don't have to send me an email and say, how do I book a reading? Because then you'll be directed to the website. It's already there for you, right? Convenience. Okay. Let's jump into it. So we'll start with love, of course. This is what people are here for. Only good news, right? Well, I guess we'll take what the cards give us. All right. Okay. Mm. All right. The hanging man at the bottom of the deck. All right. So Gemini is looking at something from a different perspective now. Something happened. Something shifted. Gemini is not doing too much. It's not too much energy. Um, exerted in regards to life right now. Kind of just going with the motion. I'm going to jump back in and make start making moves, start making waves once you gain some clarity, some enlightenment. This is like a person in in the the stage of okay, I'm just watching. You, know, you could be, you can put something on the end of that. I'm just watching him or watching her. Um, but I'm just watching right now so, so that I can make plans, right? Real plans of, of action here. Major Arcana, suspended animation. The universe wants you to look at something from a different perspective. So they've kind of put you in that, that not a fog, Maybe sometimes it could be, it could feel like a fog, like I'm just going through life, going through the motions, you know, and then you have that aha moment and it takes you out of the hanging man energy. So something about you maybe doing this in love, you know, because this is a love reading, right? Love and romance. Right. So we've got the Knight of Swords, the World, the Two of Cups, the Chariot, the Seven of Swords, the King of Wands. Okay, so we could be definitely dealing with a cancer, a cancer man or, or, or woman. Um, the Gemini feels like there has been a complete shift, a change, a door closing on an old way of dealing with um, this other person. Could be another air sign, a fire sign, and then we've got Cancer Pisces. You guys do the signs. I'm not going to do that. Um, so this is a situation where we have gone as far as we, this person may have said to you, they gave you some real strong truth where it, in their words, they were confrontational and it cut something short to where you feel like this is the ending. Or this is the ending of how we can deal with each other. It used to be, or it still could be, a successful relationship, a mutually beneficial relationship. Um, but it looks like somebody gave you some truth, or vice versa, um, about how they they're they're going to move forward alone. They need to have. A personal victory they need to get in control they they felt out of control because things surrounding you or the relationship the dynamic was uh, it uh, things start happening about in their life in their world uh, that where it made them feel out of control so they the only way they felt like they could get back in control is to um, first give you some truth about how they felt 
or maybe about a cutting off or cutting away of um and how they they have plans they've made plans it may even be secret plans um to move forward gain control by moving forward by leaving the two swords behind that two of cups relationship this relationship behind or not paying too much attention to it anymore because paying so much attention and giving so much homage or regard or respect to this relationship started to make them feel like things in their life started happening so now they had to do they had to gain control again by maybe leaving something behind and maybe they did they they are doing this or they have done this in a sneaking type of way but it was all because um it might have been because outside interference outside interference uh friends family different dynamics entities whatever but they felt like okay the only way i can gain control over this is to move forward alone be the chariot the only way i can have victory is to walk away maybe not the thing about it is they have not been like 100 percent honest with you about their plans because now they're going after what they desire their hearts desire um they're making plans in regards to what they want and no longer what either you want or what the relationship wants or needs um and now maybe you are seeing this in a in a different perspective you are the hanging man um now you see that maybe what they do they're doing for themselves is um is what they need to do and now you have to make a move go back to the hanging man in regards to you see that this person is moving forward plans for self made and solidified even if they're not spoken to you they are um it, they're moving forward and you see it by way of their actions right um so now you have to make your your next move a good one and maybe it needs to be surrounding you and not the relationship so much you know i think the both of you got lost in this dynamic in this relationship to where you you lost self-identity kind of just lost you getting lost in each other to where you know goals that you have for self are kind of like put to the wayside um different um responsibilities objectives for yourself it's, it's this person is definitely something happened and and now they need to do for self the the knight of swords in reverse it may not be much communication now the ace of wands up right looks like somebody's having the motivation to embark on their health wealth and happiness um that's their health wealth and happiness what else and, and this might need this may be the advice for you gemini get busy in your own life the eight of wands have the strength to move forward or have the communication about maybe the trouble or the jealousy in the surrounding this relationship and maybe a, a positive progression will happen in regards to it moving forward or maybe it'll die out but it looks like you want to have communication page of source you may even be spying on this person the tower something abruptly happened in regards to this relationship and someone chose up somebody chose themselves someone chose a new path um now they could have outright told you this or they could just be telling you this in their actions you know they don't call every day they don't 
there's not much regard for the relationship anymore because they're putting something else or someone else or they're just themselves first okay so that's what's going on in love the advice here for the gemini is to do the same don't be so concerned with the relationship anymore what's meant to be will be if it's meant for you to be you guys will be if it's not guess what universe will bless you with something or something else okay so let's jump into career and finance for the gemini career and finance for the gemini um so if that reading the love reading resonated with you for you no longer am i done the extended readings because that's a bit too much for me that would be 24 videos right uh but you can always request a five dollar yes or no question um so if you if you got a burning question out there um has this person taken you know a, a change are they putting themselves first do they care about the relationship anymore yes or no questions like that five dollars can't beat that with a stick um it's an email reading i pull cards for you i explain the cards i give you the yes or no answer um so take advantage of that okay no extended readings but the five dollar yes or no burning question reading <laughs> all right so career and finance for the gemini Oh, the tower upright. Okay. We have the tower at the bottom of the deck for the love, too. Okay, five of swords. All right, so keep in mind, guys, we're in Mercury. Retrograde is coming up. So things from the past. The five of swords always talks about things cropping up from the past. Long-standing issues from the past. You thought you got over it. Now they're back. Now they're bringing about change in the present. But this is issues from the past. This is not new. You can act like it's new, but it's not new. You knew. Everybody knows it's not new. Okay? So, Five of Swords, upright. All right. In regards to career and finance, the Will of Fortune, the Eight of Pentacles, the Queen of Swords. There's you, the Judgment, and the Fool. Okay. So, this may be a situation for the Gemini where um, change has happened in regards to um, something ending or the culmination of the, the culmination of could be the ten of pentacles the ten of cups the ten of wands and the ten of swords so um we know that two of those essentially are good right and then two of them not so good so there is something cropping up from the past in regards to work in money some of you you had in a an abrupt event come into your life and it shifted the fortune right um it may be coming back you thought you were over it and now you have to work more on it or into it or pay out money for it sometimes this is this could be credit this could be debtors. This could be something coming back in regards to I thought it was over. Now I have to put more work into it and have strength to do so. I'm tired of it, whatever it may be. Uh, it looks like this is a person really trying to get in control of their financial, their finances money has been up and down but it's been it hasn't been to the point where like um i can't buy food for myself and um you know or, or something of that nature but it's been a roller coaster or a situation you've dealt with has been a roller coaster has been a, a wheel it's always turning you don't know where it's stopping if it's going to be good or if it's going to be bad something crops up from the past an issue that you're going to have to battle with sometimes this looks like okay so debtors creditors uh situations you may have gotten yourself in some legal issues you thought it was over and then you got to pay out more money uh you thought that that had 
gone off of your credit file. Now you have to go and reverse and try to figure it out. Um, but whatever it may be, it looks like uh, the Gemini is getting very uh, clear, concise, and, and making a final judgment in regards to this so that they can be like the fool and start over. This is definitely like a clearing of debts. Um, the Gemini may be paying out all paying off debts too um s student loans i mean it could be anything um yeah so this this could be anything um but it looks good it takes you, the energy that you're expending on this situation takes you to the full now i can start over and possibly start over you know the right way so this is good pay the money be done with them right um make sure you get that in writing um a final the final judgment on it i'm, I'm just hearing i'm tired of paying this okay yeah the three of wands in reverse yeah you, you don't want to have to keep putting energy into this the six of pentacles in reverse. Yeah, I want to stop shoveling out my money to this situation. It, it, it's been nothing but problematic for me. Uh, so uh, yeah, this is a, this is good. It's like the paying off of debts for the Gemini in, in, in terms of career and finance. King of Pentacles. Wow. So it takes you there. Wow. Tower in reverse and then the tower upright. So it's like I'm gonna get. In control of the situation so I can avoid a disastrous situation in the near future this is absolutely beautiful Gemini this is um this is a time where a lot of people are receiving tax refunds and uh, large sums of money uh, making large purchases or considering doing so um, so lots of people are really going over their financial um, uh, um, records in, in the scope of where they are and, and really trying to be the king of pentacles some of you okay i just heard it like child support somebody wants to stop paying it somebody who hasn't been paying it um final judgment here or you're going to get child support something about that um let's this looks really good whatever you're doing takes you to the king of pentacles very good energy let's go ahead and get our advice for love then our advice for career and finance all right all right the advice for love will come from the butterfly oracle deck all right what's the advice for love for the gemini Keep the faith. All right. The advice for the Gemini. Windfall. All right. You're stronger than you know. Forgiveness. All right. Support. Okay. That's for love. Okay. Um, keep the faith. Three cards of clarity. And then we're going to move on. For the Gemini, for love, three cards of clarity, three cards of clarity in, in regards to advice for the Gemini. Keep the faith. Three of Swords, okay. Five of Swords. Six of Pentacles, okay. Page of swords at the bottom of the deck. Alright, so. Whew, lots of sources. This is definitely for the Gemini. You're stronger than you know. Forgiveness. So in love. Love. 
It might have been, there might be a separation here, a divorce from um, the relationship, maybe due to infidelity, um, lies and secrets, something cropping up from the past. Um, six of Pentacles. Somebody wants forgiveness or someone just wants balance. They made the choice to have balance in their life. And this may be in regards to you. And it may have been about walking away. They may have felt stuck in a situation. Mentally stuck, physically stuck. Or this could be you feeling stuck. Now someone wants balance. Um, upon getting that, it's about like so there was already problems in this relationship. Uh, this is a Gemini needing to get unstuck. Know that you're stronger than you know. Um, you need to get unstuck from this love relationship. Support is here. Make the choice to do what's best for you. Because somebody else has already done that. Um, page of Swords. This could be a younger Gemini. This could be you spying, needing to get more information. This is um, this is heavy energy. A situation where this is like the end. Like somebody is really, really just focused on themselves and moving forward. And it may be without the Gemini or this is the Gemini's energy. I'm focused on myself and not this relationship. Okay. Alright. So that's that for uh, love. Okay. So we will get the advice for career and finance. Career and finance. Yeah. Tell the Gemini for career and finance. Career and finance. Perfect timing. Improving health. Wow. In the near future. Yes. This is beautiful. So we know that health encompasses every, you know, facet of health. Physical, financial, uh, emotional, spiritual health. And it's improving for you. We saw that in that spread. Like, Gemini is getting very exact about their financial matters and their financial affairs. Um because they want to improve their financial health and, and you know and it, it, it read it read like that perfect timing uh, let's do three cards to clarify got a yes answer so wow so, um in regards to finances nice 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 some of you trying to buy a house trying to work on credit trying to work on uh, important documents tax related i mean it could be anything just really trying to get in control of the financial affairs perfect timing improving health in the near future this is nice the high priestess You've made a plan. You're holding it to yourself. You you, you hold the scroll. Things are, are turning in your favor. Okay. The Knight of Cups. The Ten of Wands. Uh, the Five of Swords again. The World of Fortune. This is the Queen of Swords again. Nice. So this is... I've made a plan so that I can get what I want. I'm laying down the burden of... Of what I've been carrying this is like paying out a lot or, or taking care of a lot because it is it just keeps coming back you, you think you get over it or you gotten over it but it comes back so this is the Gemini dealing with it so that the wheel can turn in Gemini's favor this is very nice so yes you will be fortunate just know that you've got to deal with some things 
to move forward okay ask your angels this is beautiful you really have to go into this much more whatever you're doing in regards to financial planning gemini looks really good it may be working with a financial planner the energy is good gemini if you feel like this reading resonated with you for you go over to my website book um any type of reading for yourself uh several different readings on the um, the book online uh tab also you can um purchase the the special readings uh the link for the five dollar yes or no question reading will be below all of my information is below thank you gemini for tuning in thank you know that i am praying for you pray for me as well take care guys